Hi everyone, so yeah, I'm Sabina from the Movies team, and I'm gonna provide a brief update of the activity category project, which will be better known as the activity icons as well. So the discovery research uh, conducted during the redesign of the activity cards reveal a need for having some kind of organization or a structure within the Moodle activity. And after the workshop conducted with some of uh, the XQ staff to group core activities into categories, the next step was to conduct a design sprint workshop with the UX team to explore the best possible solutions. So we conducted the workshop last Thursday and we ran through a series of exercises to understand the user needs and challenges and to develop potential solutions to solve the problem. So I've added here the most relevant exercise we went through so you can better understand the process we, we follow. So with the how much we questions exercise, we uncovered the biggest challenges of the project at an early stage. So we make sure we are considering all the possible obstacles before starting to work on the on the solution. Then we grouped similar how might we questions into groups or themes to identify the most challenging areas. And after these two exercises, we started the sketching phase with the crazy aid and the solution sketch activities. So in the crazy eight, we sketches, uh, sketch uh, eight different solutions in eight minutes, focusing on creativity rather than technical feasibility and trying to think out of the box. And finally, in the solution sketch exercise, we develop one idea into a more detailed solution, taking as a base the ideas uh, we all generated during the, the crazy eight uh, activity. So in the screen so that you see on the, oh, sorry, go back again to the other one, sorry. Yeah, uh, in the screenshot on the right side, you can see example of the affinity mapping exercise on the top uh, and the ideas generated on the crazy exercise at the bottom. Uh, you also have the link to the Myro board of the workshop in the, in the title of the slide in case that someone wants to have a look. Um, and yeah, I have to say that the outcome of the workshop was really good. The quality and creativity of the ideas generated by everyone was incredible. So I would like to give a big thanks to the entire UX team for the help and the collaboration in the project. It was a great experience working together, guys. And yeah, now if you can go to the next slide, Adrian, please. So yeah, in terms of next steps, uh, this Thursday, the UX team will have another um, sort of session in which we will discuss on the UI and customization approach for this project, as well as defining the core activity categories uh, based on all the feedback that we collected previously through the community and also through the um, workshop that we uh, we conducted a few months ago. And yeah, that's it from me.